the home team classics to receive the honors of the opening kickoff in their dark blue dc in an unfamiliar white combo will dc play upset to this otherwise dominant season at canton and make their first title appearance in nearly 20 uh, nearly 15 seasons i should say this kickoff not returned at the 20 will introduce the canton offense in just a moment and mickey this canton offense has been good in fairly much every aspect of play just try to get their first first down of the game. Same formation. They'll flip it to the triple is to the left. In fact, they'll move it back to where it was. Here, DC playing a man look with short corners here. Patterson drops back. Pressure again. Got there and he's gone. Patterson dumped in the backfield. Stacked two synergies right here. Shabazz will drop back. He's going to get it off this time. Looking down for Gill. Couldn't find him. Patterson faked the handoff. Lee went into block. Patterson had a rusher behind him. He's found a man downfield. Dilla Senior going up past the 30 and saving the day was Daryl Bullock back at the 25. DC would do well to get a hold here in third and 11 after that huge play to Dilla Senior. Patterson rolls out again. This is dangerous. He's found him for a first down again. They just need to stop him here. Patterson going to throw it. Owens caught just shy of the goal line. Yeah, hand off this time they run it. Lee beat the first man. Strong carry from Logan Lee gets the one yard touchdown and Canton the first up on the board. And, and nobody has been able to do so this year. Single back again is Lee. Hand off his fate though. Patterson's gonna roll out. Another deep look. This is picked again. Going back in the other direction. What a turnaround there again. Tyler, uh, not Tyler Hope, but it's Jason Strongbow. Shabazz hasn't completed a pass yet in this game. Is this the time now? Synergy drops back. Look, stack one. Caught to Vichy. Hung on for dear life, and he's got a first down. DJ killed Gannon with that tackle, and that means that Porty Porty will hook this one in for a three point. So not a complete disaster for the DC Dragons, but certainly not what they would have wanted. And uncharacteristic of Scar Patterson in this Canton passing offense. In motion, one of these receivers is Gibson from right to left. Patterson, handoff, faked. Patterson rolls out to his left. Plenty of time to throw. Picked again! He's got a hat trick in the first half. And going back the other way, he's almost returned care. They've, they've given it up again. You've got Potty Potty, the top kicker in the league this year. The most field goal attempts. He's been perfect all year. Let's see if he can stay perfect here in the semifinals. And a field goal from Potty Potty is up and through. and In five passes that completion at the at the start of this drive. Logan Lee up to the 40. He is motoring now, Logan Lee. It was a classic hospital pass there from Scar Patterson. Patterson drops back this time, zips it. Caught Wall did brilliantly. Reeled that in with tough coverage around him. That's too straight for Jack Wall. Interceptions, first game. It's gotta get in his head. Patterson, pressure, gone! Scar Patterson sacked for the second time tonight, and guess who? It's Jason Strongbow. He made an all-star appearance in his final season with Sioux Falls last season, but I'll tell you what, this is one of the best individual performances I've seen from a defensive player in only 15 minutes. Don't miss a minute of SFL or SLM action. And help the channel grow through your support. Synergy on third down and long. Rolls out. Got great protection from his line. Synergy's going to rush it, and he's going to get absolutely whacked. At the line of scrimmage, nothing doing there for DC once again. And Canton's going to get another stop. Not Scar Patterson, he wants the smoke. He's going to roll out again here. Downfield look, caught one-on-one, -on -one, Ryan Owens. If they could get their offense going, it's still only a one-score game. Ems hooks it from right to left. He strikes it and likes it. It's up through the middle, from what I can remember. Patterson, hand off outside, lead with the juke move, kept going, 
Vasquez, he got beaten as well. Logan Lee, terrific run on the outside. Flips the field. The other side, if you're, if you're canting right now. Pressure from DC. Patterson had to make a decision. He's got a wide open man. Dylan Pree beat the first man. Caught at the goal line. What a tackle. Getting across there. So close to six points. I'm, re I'm recruited to do this and not wear black and white on the sideline. Hand off to Logan Lee. Can he get two? Yes, he will. And Canton are going to stretch this margin out to 14 points. The ship in Nashville next season. With a huge catch there to get his Dragons moving. Picked off! No! Huge result for Canton. And Mark Grenick finally gets on the end of one. He's been threatening to do it all night. Someone set up to run the ball here. But Patterson's going to throw. Downfield. That's a flag. He caught it anyway. Got the pass to the Ferris, but he said, I'm still going to reel this in. Drops back. There's a roll out here for Patterson off the play action. He zips it across his body. Jack Wall caught. And he'll be down at the 10. Canton again in the red zone. By DeSantis on the far side. Patterson drops back. Wall caught. Touchdown. Jack Wall's got one. And this one's now fast getting away from the Dragons. APM Music is the official soundtrack of the Simulation Football League. To explore their library, to find the perfect tracks for your projects, visit apmusic.com. Say has lost it. Grenex fallen on it, has he? No, DC hold on to the ball. What happened there? It looked like the Rockefeller come up with it. it. It does. There was no other white jersey around. I, I can only assume Rockefeller came That's up with I it. That's what I thought. But it didn't look like the scoreboard had flicked over like it does with every other turnover. But yeah. Grenek has fallen on the ball. So that's five turnovers in this game, and the offense just couldn't produce. And off outside Logan Lee. Got past Vasquez. Here he goes. Peanut say couldn't get there. And in the end, he had to go back from behind to catch Logan Lee, who just kept running downfield. DC's defense has done all it can tonight. You cannot fault the way that they played. They've had four turnovers, a number of stops on third down. Patterson drops back. Can he find the end zone? Zips it to the backfield. Bob Long's got a lot of work to do. He's going to get up over the line of scrimmage, but no further than that. And Robert Ems will trot out here to kick his third field goal tonight. It's not enough time, unfortunately. The DC six and a half minutes remaining. His field goal from Ems is up and good. Four wide, single back. Is say synergy drops back, zips it downfield. Oh, Da Vinci did everything he could, but the ball ended up being jarred free by King Jamal and more. I was being actively convinced to try and come to Houston this year. It's not quite going to happen, but that should be a fantastic weekend and a great way, as always, to open up the next campaign of SFL football. But it looks like Canton have booked their spot for a rematch. Two and a half minutes left here. And off to the outside to find Logan Lee. He will pick up a first down, just motoring forward Logan Lee. And this entire game, second only to Mr. DeSantis. It's been unreal. Third down and goal, three to go to the stripe. Hand off to the outside, Logan Lee. Can he get the triple? Not quite. He will roll over and will be marked. At the one, DeSantis again on the tackle. Up here for Rob Ems. It's going to be his fourth of the night. And that one sails through. It's 33 to Canton. Game, set, bingo. Canton have punched their ticket into their first ever title game appearance.